that you need to work on? What do you want to work on? If it were up to you, although it's not up to you. <laughs> what, what, what do you think, Corey? What would you say? Um, I'm working great. Okay. You want to practice that? Yeah. Um, escaping mode. Escaping mode. Okay. There you go. All right, so. That's a good one. Um, so we're going to be working on escaping. Uh, arm lock from from guard. We can give that to you in just a few minutes, like before or after class, and any day of the week. Okay. So, um, but the thing with the arm lock, the thing with every everything is you have to practice it a lot. All right. So maybe actually maybe before you guys leave, we'll let Dad record a real quick arm lock from guard tutorial, and then you guys can watch it. We haven't done that yet, right? Okay, so we have a lot of things we want to go over. See that whole list? And that list. So we want to go over a lot of things, and, and uh, we wanted to have Dad here today. Do you know why? Did Dad tell you why? Why? Well, yeah, he has got learners. Everybody's got a medical defense here, right? So since you guys got mats and you're working at home, we want Dad to have the most knowledge he can to help you guys at home, to help the kids at home, so you can practice efficiently and get as best as you possibly can with Dad's help. But in able to do that, we need Dad to really understand jujitsu and how it works, right? And the thing about that is, is a lot of jujitsu is concepts. Remember us talking about concepts a lot? And your dad is gonna be able to understand these concepts probably a lot better and quicker than you guys are, which is gonna help us and help him teach you how to learn concepts. Yeah. Just sometimes they're hard to figure and out. And Dad knows you guys a little bit better than we do. So we think that Dad might have a, a good method to help you understand some things that we might not be so great at explaining to you, right? So we can explain them to Dad on a, on a little bit of a higher level, and then he can explain them to you and break them down over time as you're working while we're trying to do the same thing. Make sense? All right, we're gonna get started, okay? Um, I, I do wanna say quick, here's the first thing we're gonna talk about. So, you mentioned the arm lock from guard, right? So the arm lock from guard is great. Any submission is great, because that's our ultimate goal, right? For me to submit Cody if I'm going with him. But, if we end up here, and I'm on the ground and Coach Cody has me in side control, how am I going to arm lock him from guard? I can't. Why can't I? I can't arm lock him from guard because I'm not. He's not in my guard, right? So that means that the most important thing about jujitsu isn't really the the arm lock. It's about being able to change your positions to get to a position where you can do the submission you want. All right? And then the second thing is, we don't want to just know an arm lock from guard, we want to know an arm lock from every position. All right? Every single position. And there's arm locks from every position. Every position. I could straight arm lock Cody from guard, but I could also straight arm lock Cody from side control. I can also straight arm lock Cody from back control in like three different ways. You know? So that's the part. So what we want is to get the basic knowledge of the arm lock, and then we can just start applying it wherever we're at. Does that make sense? That makes sense, right? All right. So, first thing is, what is, here's what we're going to do. We're going to talk about the most important technique, basically in jiu-jitsu, but more importantly, the most important technique in or escaping. What do you think that is? Say it if you know. If you don't know, it's fine. I'm going to tell you in a second anyway. Dad, what do you think it is? Um, being able to like shrimping. What do you guys think? It, in escaping. So the most important technique in jujitsu, but more importantly for escaping. Alright, so we got two elbow escapes on a shrimp. 
Well, here's the, here's the secret, right? The shrimp and the elbow escape, it's the same thing. And it's also the correct answer, okay? It's also the correct answer. So, the one thing that we want you to get the best at and understand more than anything else is a shrimp. And I know we talk about it all the time. And we're always like, yeah, do it, and we're doing it now, and we did it last time, and we're gonna probably do it again next time. But that's, that's what's so important about practicing, okay? So right now, I want to see your shrimps. All of you. And we're even going to make Dad do this, too. Oh, all right? this is embarrassing. Nope. I don't know if you want to record Daddy this or not. Easy. Um, yeah, maybe we'll just pause so, this. So here, let's see. Let's see.